This week on C Plus News Time, Mike Birbiglia suggests Keegan Michael Key and Jillian Jacobs don't think twice. Hulu renews difficult people for an easier second season, and Comedy Central's cartoon absurdist show Trip Tank is coming back in September. Do you remember this? C Plus News Time. It's C Plus News Time with your host, Chad White. Welcome back to C Plus News Time. I'm your host, Chad White, and this is the comedy news you didn't know about for the week of August 24th, 2015. Not much happened in the way of news this week, so let's get on with the first story. First up, Keegan Michael Key and Jillian Jacobs are joining Mike Birbiglia's new movie, Don't Think Twice. The writer of the book, Sleepwalk With Me, and then the star of the movie, Sleepwalk With Me, Mike Birbiglia, is making a new movie and is called Don't Think Twice. It's about a group of improv people that do improv and they're losing their home theater at the same time one of them is going on to star in a big sketch comedy tv show this movie is going to be about the bitterness and backstabbing that can happen in the improv world and they all have to learn that maybe not everybody's going to make it to the big time keegan michael key and julian jacobs are joining mike birbiglia who's leading it kate micucci tammy sager and chris gethard Birbigli is writing and directing the movie, and one of the executive producers is one of the biggest names in producing. It's Ira Glass. Really good. You should know his work. Production is underway in New York right now. Mike Birbigli is really good at what he does in stand-up comedy, and his writing is pretty impeccable, too. In Sleepwalk With Me, he played himself as a comedian that sleepwalks and he has these issues, especially when he's touring and it's just a really big problem. He even jumped out of a hotel window. Just go watch the movie, it's great, and the book is just as good. My Birbigli is really good at this heartfelt stand-up and it's especially seen in probably one of my favorite stand-up specials, My Boyfriend's Girlfriend. Uh, you can watch it anywhere, basically, and it's a 71-minute story of how Mike Birbiglia essentially met his wife and how he gets over, how he gets through life as a, as an aspiring comedian. Mike Birbiglia is one of the best out there. If you're not watching him, you're doing comedy wrong. Next up, Hulu renews Difficult People for a second season. While there are only three or four or five episodes in at the time of this recording, Difficult People has proven to be a really good boon for Hulu, so naturally they decided to renew the series for a second season. The Amy Poehler produced sitcom, I don't even know if it's a sitcom, sitcom is now, it's coming into a second season and it stars Billy Eichner and Julie Klausner and it's really funny because it, it deals with their personalities and them being these, these funny Twitter slash writing comedians that, that are just mean to people all the time and uh, how they try to make it up in the business but they just can't seem to really hit that sweet spot you know everybody everybody uh if they, every time they meet julie julie on the show they're like oh you're that girl who writes the really mean things on twitter you're in the really mean tv recaps and then billy is like they're like billy you're the guy who says one-liners that show is really written with comedians especially them in mind and it's really good to see how bitingly funny that show can be and really really mean they they take swings at everybody they take swings at alice and janney and daniel tosh and just you know other things it's a really good show also stars james urbank he's a really funny guy uh he's professor venture from the venture brothers and he's a bunch of other things but mostly the venture brothers of course anyway julie klausner said this she said that i'm the luckiest girl in the world to be able to make more episodes of difficult people this must be what it feels like to win the lottery, have a fast metabolism, or win an Oscar for My Cousin Vinny. And finally, Comedy Central's what they're calling anthology series, but really it's more like Robot Chicken, but in mostly cartoon form. Uh, Trip Tank is now coming back September 25th at midnight on Fridays and everything on Comedy Central. This season is probably going to be just as big as the first one. Everybody seemed to like that weird, absurdist stuff. I like it. It's a, it's a really, I like, the, I like anything that's just being different. And this season is going to include everything from 2D to stop motion to CGI. And there's going to be uh, 10 episodes in this season, all half hour. It's going to showcase a wide range of fast-paced, hard-hitting animated comedy shorts weaving together standalone and recurring narrative pieces. This season is going to feature the voices of Margaret Cho, Andrew Dice Clay, Jermaine Clement, Cheryl Hines, Niecy Nash, Neo, Jordan Peele, Paul Reiser, Amy Schumer, David Hasselhoff, John Hamm, 
Nick Swartzen, and so many other people that I just don't care to read off their names. But most importantly, John Hamm, because I love that guy. And that's all the news I have for you for this week's news time. Why don't you subscribe and watch one of our other videos? I'm sure that we have something that will entice you, something funny, something newsworthy, or just something to love. You can also visit the website, cpluscomedy.com. Like us on Facebook. Uh, follow us on Twitter. Follow me on Twitter, at Chad Black White, and tumble with us on Tumblr. Until next time, you have a good day. And I'm going to finish this catchphrase right now. Look out for that t-shirt.